We are now kicking off against the Green Bay Packers, and I did not fix straight May's fucking sleeves again. Still? Still, because remember we were oh. talking about it, and then the shit happened, so I backed out, got back on, and then as soon as I was fixing to play, I had to go fucking... Uh. Pussy. Fans are going to shit their pants when they do finally see him walk out there with tight sleeves on his jersey. Oh my god! He's change. got the drip! Like Jalen Miro wearing a sleeve. Oh yeah. I wonder what that was about. <laughs> he like, had to earn it. He played a hell of a game though when he wore it. I think well, he, against didn't LSU? He, yeah, I was going to say, I think he started it against LSU. Yep. He did. I wonder how Desmond Ritter's mental is, you know, being the backup now. Probably ready to shoot everybody in the organization. Yeah, probably after leading y'all to a Super Bowl last, a Super Bowl win. Last no, year. he did not. I mean, yes, we all, he did. We he all need to be honest about that. We all he need to be honest about that. Bijan, if Bijan could throw the ball, he would play quarterback. Let's, let's be honest here. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking about, dude. Like Bijan is your team, like last year. It at was. Least. But, like, you know, uh, this is going to help your team become better, I think. Absolutely. I mean, hell. Um, shit, last week we scored 41 points and kept up with the Chiefs. The only thing that stopped us was our defense. Yep. I really want to have a fucking, like, just a breakout game of Drake May, though. Yeah. I'm waiting I mean, for last, that from Stroud. Last week was kind of that, in a way. Ah, God damn it. And, uh, I mean, 200 and something passing yards, one touchdown that it didn't fucking give him. So he had two passing touchdowns, 70 yards on the ground, 66% completion percentage. I mean, maybe you could call that his breakout game. Maybe. I tell you what, old Jordan Mason's glad I cut Ladamian Webb. Really? Yeah, he's you finally didn't cut some him. Touches. You moved him down. Well, moved him down. So now he's finally get some touches. Yeah. Ah. Well, three and out. These old boys mind they can't get their head out of the gutter. They're like the Eagles right now. The Eagles lost three fucking games and everybody's losing their mind about it. Oh, I know. Are they going to bench Jalen Hurts? Ah, uh, you too, brother. Are they going to bench Jalen Hurts? What are they going to do? What? People was mm -hmm. actually saying that? There was a analyst that said the best thing for the Eagles right now is to start Marcus Mariota. Wow. And that was like two weeks ago. Wow. Why would do pe people in the NFL have lost their goddamn? Granted, I will say he does have a fair amount of turnovers this year, interception wise, but he still is what makes them what they are. Yeah, he could. He's the reason they're losing, but he's also the reason they're winning. Come on, somebody tackle this motherfucker. Jesus. That was like the longest nine-yard run I've ever seen in my life. Just took 30 seconds for Aaron Jones to go nine yards. What are you playing, FIFA? Mm-hmm. How'd you know? I saw it. I seen it. It's not FIFA anymore. It's FC. FC. Yeah. Which I why'd like. They, they, why'd they change from FIFA? Because FIFA wanted a shit ton of money just for the naming rights. Like, wanted almost a billion dollars. And so they're like, huh, well, we already own all the leagues, rights, and player rights, so go fuck yourself. Pretty yeah. much. Which, uh, that's what, you know, that's what EA football's doing, the uh, college game. <clears throat> they're not, it's not going to be NCAA, it's going to be. Um, 
but college just, football. Yeah, just yeah. EA college football. Yeah. Which I like because they can add in penalties again. Like, I've got uh, two starting offensive linemen out. Bijan's out. Bobby Wagner's out for the game. Damn. We're beat Dude, up. that fucking that uh forced fumble that he had, that they like called back Saint in the Saints game mm -hmm. was insane. Did you win earlier? Nope. What happened? A fumble and uh, I'll, it's just little stuff, you know. The ticky tack bullshit. Yeah, but it's okay. It's all good. Can't win them all, you know. And I'll play Jesse next week, so I'm sure I'll get back on track. <laughs> And I play Hunter next, who simmed the last five minutes of his game because he's getting murdered by the Jags, and I got on his ass. I was what, not happy. What did he say? He was like, "Well, I just don't like fucking getting beat, and I'm tired of the playing the Jags." I'm like, "Well, you got to play them two times a year, every year, for the rest of your life." <laughs> so, he was just upset. Which, whatever. I'm guessing it wasn't a close game. I don't know. He sent something on the Snapchat group of, uh, what's his name? Of some bullshit. Like, I will give him it was some bullshit. Oh, yeah. He was hitting Trevor Lawrence. The ball went backwards and come back fucking forward to the wide open receiver yeah. while he was getting sacked. And, yeah. uh, he said, that that's what lost me the fucking game. No, it's not. So, I don't know. <laughs> not what lost him the game. He gave up. Like he, I, I'm sure it was only like a one. Like he, sometimes I listen to him and it'll be like he's down 20 points and just getting fucked, and then he'll like lose the game by like <clears> up or <throat> down. No. But whatever. Who is this fat piece of shit running the ball up here? Fucking fat fuck. Motherfucker. Get a 12 yard fucking run and we're holding. The two of them sliming out. The fucking back yeah, Oh, and I missed, I missed three field goals because the wind was absolutely fucking insane, but the Bears also missed two. Hmm. The, the In Chicago? Wind was like, oh, yeah. The wind was like 17 miles an hour and it was like saying this way, but it was swirling. For sure. Yeah. Well, I mean, it, that sucks. But it's cool yeah, that they I added did, yeah. that, you know, in Chicago it's windy as fuck. Uh huh. I'm not, dude. I'm not mad at all. Like, I'm, I'm very proud of my team this year so far. You know what I mean? Like, I really am. <laughs> Me on the other hand, I'm pissed. Yeah. Livid. Can't do shit with these. Fucking bums on this team. Bunch of sorry sons of bitches. <laughs> Thought I'd put together a god squad, and here we are at three and three. What is this? Young team's young. That's what it is, in my opinion. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. the second goddamn time they brought up my losing streak mm. and we're two minutes left in the first quarter <laughs> yeah what uh what's the score three to nothing packers are winning but i've got the ball on the 38 going in is no one gonna run up dude what the fuck are y'all doing 
I'm just playing with like a random team just to fucking play. I said, is that a fact? Yeah. Why do you have mosquitoes inside of your house in the middle of December? <laughs> well, I saved them. Saved them? Yeah, they were in the wilderness. And a Been wild. nursing them up. <laughs> yeah. Kept a bowl of water in my room. Put some larva in it. Larva. Made things happen. I'm outside, can you tell? Yeah, put on a garbage can. Yep. Old dumb bitch. Touchdown, Xavier Leggett, out of the Wildcat. Touchdown, who? Xavier Leggett, man. Oh, nice. The rookie. Oh, my God, on extra point, my starting center just got hurt. I'm down three, starting off Salama now. <laughs> yeah, Laramie, Laramie kept getting hurt last game. He got hurt, and then uh, I brought him back in because it was like a strained shoulder mm -hmm. some shit. Brought him back in, he played about another quarter, and then he got hurt with a dislocated shoulder out two weeks. <laughs> so you did Sorry, it. Right. Yeah. Dude, I'm going to be honest. So the offense for the Bears, 81, and uh, defense is 87. They're really good. They're really good. Really good on defense. There's a skater. At the end of one, the Atlanta Falcons oh, my are Peter. leading 7-3. Get it all. There's a skater. Oh, my all right, Peter. Alright, alright. Alright, that's enough. That's enough. Get it all. That's enough. You don't like that song? It's enough. Well, you don't like it? No, it's terrible. It's enough. Skeeter. It's enough. What the fuck are you doing to be breathing so hard right now? Cleaning up my car. What are you doing? Huh? I'm playing Madden. I'm not breathing hard. My goddamn mic. Yeah, you're cutting out. Hello. I hear you now. The mic keeps unplugging. It's like I'm outside or something. Fucking idiot. Well, they just mentioned my losing streak for the third time. Thanks for reminding me, Brandon. I almost forgot that I've lost two straight. What, buddy? I said, thanks for reminding me, Brandon. I almost forgot that I've lost two straight. He just said something <laughs> about it again. again. The third time. We're not even a minute into the second quarter. <laughs> Yeah, these Falcons have lost three straight. Yeah, I know, Brandon. Huh? I just cannot believe they lost three straight. I know, Brandon. <laughs> Brandon, I fucking know. Like Charles is even getting pissed. <laughs> Brandon, that's enough. <laughs> <clears throat> Are y'all going to keep fucking up and putting him on Kyle Pitts, aren't you? They've got Kenny Clark in man coverage on Kyle Pitts. I'll tell you what would happen. Gabe would fire that ass. You hear me? What? No. I said they've put K 
Kenny Clark in man coverage on Kyle Pitts two plays in a row. And I said, I'll tell you what would happen. This fucking Gabe would fire that ass. Yeah. Fire that motherfucker. He's fired. That's a fired ass. That might have been the dumbest shit I've ever experienced. <laughs> like, and he just kept trying to argue it. Yeah. See, and the I'll thing is, like, the thing is, he probably hasn't even fixed that because he's still running the same defense, like the playbook. Yeah. And still keeps playing somebody in that spot. Well, that was just a situation, like I thought, you know, like. Yeah, he, he got was... hurried up to hurry up too, didn't he? Yeah. Yeah. Just a dumbass. Fire. Dumbass. I'm in the fantasy playoffs, baby. Oh yeah. Puka went off for me yesterday. I'm killing our losers bracket right now. I'm winning. Uh, right now, I have a 54% chance to win. Went off for me. I'll tell you what, the guy I'm playing, though, has 90 points on his bench between Matthew Stafford and George Pickens. Can't hear you if you're talking to me. Did you hear what I said about George Pickens? That's what I just said. Is it? Oh, but, yeah. Uh, the guy I'm playing against has uh, 90 points on his bench between Matthew Stafford and George Pickens. <laughs> oh, my God. I bet he's pissed. I put Drake out last week. Did you? Nice. Mm -hmm. He was a two seed. Tyreek got hurt and didn't play, and somebody else got hurt and didn't play, like Alave or somebody. Yeah. So he, he really had no shot. He would have beat the fuck out of me if they would have played. <sighs> was it that bad? I mean, what? like, did your team play that bad or something? Well, I started fucking Sam Howe, who had like three points and this and that. So, I mean, I beat him like 106 yeah. to 95 or something. And Tyreek and Chris Olave didn't play for him, so. Ah. God, fucking Musgraves. Forgot about him. Oh, yeah, he's good. He fucking ripped me a new asshole last year. Yeah. Yep, he's good. Here you go, Simpson. Trent Simpson with the sack. Nice. Has he done anything for you? When he plays, he I've got him in one particular formation. Or I rotate them all in like the nickel. Yeah. But there's like one nickel set that gets played more than the rest of them because most of the time I just run coach suggestions. Yeah. And so 90% of the time I think it's a... Uh, Bobby Wagner and James Williams or James Williams and Damone Clark yeah that play and that's pretty much you know 90% of what we run is the nickel yeah And touchdown Musgraves. Fucking please. Everybody. Oh, they got a fake field goal on my ass. And he oh, scored. They hit. Did you ever see my uh, my fake punt? Yes. <laughs> In the... What game was that? I think it might have been the Raiders. <clears throat> yeah, I saw it. 
I'm open smart. And, open and drive fake field goal with motherfucking uh, Jaheim Bell. I'll take it. Yeah, I seen it. Beautiful ball there, buddy. Great job, Drake. That was pretty. Did I sense sarcasm? No. For real. Sent to tell me. Oh my god, what a run by Xavier Leggett. Holy shit. Good one, huh? Oh yeah. Right after Drake May's beautiful ball. I got to see a replay. I want to count broken tackles here. Oh, of course, they don't show the end of it. Or they only show the end of it. One, two, three, four, three off of like one out of one spot. So there's like four or five on that play. Nice. Yeah, that passed to Richie James was one, uh, 47 yards. That pretty ball I was talking about Drake through. Yeah. Three plays, 80 yards, minute 15 seconds. The first play was a negative three yard Wildcat run with uh, Drake May. Jordan loves nine for nine. Gotta love it. Oh, that was his oh, last yeah. drive. Last drive, he went nine for nine. Good job, James. I need to go fix this real quick. What is it? It's got Troy Anderson playing the sub linebacker spot for Bobby Wagner since he's out, and I want. Uh, oh yeah. I'm gonna probably put Simpson in to play it. Simpson and Damon Clark. Two minute warning up twenty one to ten.
I talked uh, shit the other day to some French people on Call of Duty. <laughs> but it was all through, like, Google Translate. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, did you translate any of their stuff? Or you really uh, could, could No. You? No. You could have uh, let like put it on speaker and let Google do it from there. Yeah. Yeah. It was funny, though. What the fuck, man? It was like a it was like a woman, and I was asking to see her big pepperoni nipples, <laughs> and she was like laughing her ass off, and then her boyfriend <clears throat> got mad and was like, "Fuck you, fuck America, fuck like whatever." <laughs> I was like, I was like, "Fuck you, you little French dick bitch." <laughs> you probably made them break up. I hope so. French girls are hot. They don't deserve to be with Frenchmen. Arnold Eva Katie with the sack. Oh. Yeah, he's been doing good for you, hasn't he? He's been alright. At least in the game. God off, damn, so man. Fuck. Producing. What happened? There's two or three plays this drive where they're just like breaking stupid tackles as soon as they catch the ball. Yeah. And then it just happened again, like right at the goal line. Mm-hmm. Like, like he's getting hit when he catches it, and then the other guy comes in and gives him a shoulder, and he just shucks it off after he's already fallen down from the original guy hitting him. Yeah. And it, like, re makes him regain his fucking balance, and he's in for a touchdown. I'm thinking about making a fucking 6-9... Goalkeeper on <laughs> Massive. But I haven't made up my mind yet. I say do it. Fuck it. Yeah, I'm just trying to decide what league I want to go to. I'm hoping we'll get a preview for NCAA or the college football game during the playoffs this year. Yes, I've heard I watched that, that video. Which video? From Eric Mayweather. Oh, uh, yeah. What did he say? I haven't seen it. Talking about they expect, he heard somebody say that they mm -hmm. should, everybody should expect something, you know, before then or by then. Yep. I hope so. Dude, that's gonna be so fucking hype. Like watching Alabama beat the shit out of Michigan <laughs> at halftime, and then you see like a dark screen. It's been 10 years. I can't remember if they waiting. said expect by the playoffs or expect by the national championship. The yeah. national championship. Probably national championship, more eyeballs. Mm hmm. They probably have it out, like, right now. Or, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, have it put together. Yeah. Can we get a stop? Well, it's not looking like a good decision to start George Kittle over Kyle Pitts, but how are you supposed to fucking know better? Oh, you? Yeah. Kyle Pitts has one reception, 24 yards, and a touchdown right now. Not like in the game, but yeah. like fantasy. Yeah.
what you get, Jordan Love. Fuck you. What user do you do? Picked, I user picked him with Jesse Bates. Oh, yeah, I did that against him a couple times. Throwing across his fucking body like he's a rod and I jumped her out. Mm hmm. Good for you. Good lord. I just had a guy wide fucking open. Touchdown, Kyle Pitts, motherfucker. Nice. What's the score? 28 to uh, 17. Nice. That's, that's crazy. That touchdown pass to Kyle Pitts was 23 yards. His one in real life was 24. What? And he just got another fucking catch, so he's up to 12 points. So it's not looking good that he's on my bench. Mm. <sighs> I got 73 points with like four players yet. You have to play. Well, I've got, fucking... I've got 68 with two not playing. Oh, uh, nice. But yeah, fucking, digs fucking shit. I've got shit seven. I've got seven total points on my bench because I sat Sam Howell and he's got negative 5.36. Yeah, I got Brock Purdy, uh, A. Shane yet to play, Jake Ferguson from the Cowboys, and Brandon Auburn from the Cowboys, and the fucking Jets have 15 points against I'm, the Commanders. Yeah, I'm glad Drake talked <clears throat> into picking up Baker Mayfield. Yeah, he's on my opponent's bench. He's got Jalen Hurts starting. He said, uh, you should definitely, I think you should get a different quarterback, is what Drake texts me. Because Stroud's normally my guy. Mm. But he's out. Mm -hmm. Aaron Jones has fucking 80 yards, so that's, that's looking nice. What, in real life? Yeah. Nice. We need to get in one together, or let me in that one next year. No, you don't work at m and I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. You don't work at <laughs> I was waiting. I was waiting on you to say that. That's why I got quiet. <laughs> We need to do a family one with, like, all our dads and shit. Oh, I don't fucking... My dad don't do that shit. The only thing he's my ever done was uh, he used to do college football pick -ems. Dude, my dad don't either. That's what would be fun. They would fuck... Dude, we had two guys in our fantasy league at the bar or whatever, and they're fucking... In, they're both, like, one and two seed in a playoff. <laughs> Yeah, Daddy and a bunch of his guys at work, they used to do college football pick -ems. Yep. And whoever had the best record at the end of the year won whatever it was. Yeah, my mom used to do that shit and always, like, make me pick for her. Yeah, he'd ask me about them. And uh, she won it every fucking year just about in the bowl games and stuff. Because I guess people at her office, like, a bunch of women didn't know what the fuck they were doing. <laughs> Did you win like a hundred bucks? That was a lot of money back in the early 2000s. Is Xavier Leggett is starting to break out at running back. Mm -hmm. He's got seven rushes, 120 yards, and two touchdowns this week. Last week he went for 120. Had a rushing and a receiving touchdown. Nice. 
He's starting to ease into it, you know what I'm saying? Easing in. Yeah. Just the tip right now. He's playing just the tip. Just the tip. Yeah, good. Good for him. You know, him. as it comes out of my mouth, he gets tackled for a loss. Good for him. Some of these French stadiums, because I'm like renaming the stadiums on here, because you mm -hmm. can. It's pretty cool. Kyle Pitts, it's, another touchdown. His fucking name is Stade, Stade Francois Coty. Coty. I'm famous. With a T or with a D? It's uh, C O T Y. Another three play draft. Four. Yeah, Kyle Pitts just scored another touchdown. Wow. Looks like we might actually get out of our slump this week, boys. It's yeah. 35 to 17. Yeah, that team's good, but it's like they don't have any people to rush the passer. Yeah. Because they they lost, uh, what's his name? Rashawn. Mm -hmm. Mr. Gary. And I think the Vikings are number one in their division. It was crazy. He three. pulled a Brett Favre on him, said, fuck y'all, I'm going to Minnesota. Yep, pretty much. They care about me more than pieces of shit. I tell you what, they wanted to pay him more than I would have paid his ass. Oh, dude, they fucking threw the bag at him. <laughs> <laughs> he said, you would not sack Baker Mayfield this coming year. Yeah. I wonder how Baker's doing. I mean, that's actually like a... Three and three or something. The team is. I don't know what he, how good he is. No, I think they're five and. Oh, really? I thought it was yeah, three like and three. Five yeah. and two. This name, this name of the stadium is Stade Abbe Du Champs. Your shop. The shops. Oh my God. Jesus oh. Christ. Marcus Jones just got murdered on a screenplay they ran on third down after Aaron Jones just threw Trenton Simpsons to the fucking dirt like he's a toddler. <laughs> Who did that to him? Aaron Jones. Nice. He had a couple big runs against me. The battle of the one and fives this week. <laughs> what a play by Marcus Jones. What a pick. That's going to be fun. They better stream it. <laughs> I can't wait to hear them bitch to each other. It's going to be perfect. They're going to like best friends. I think Jesse doesn't like him. This stadium's name is Stade. Uh, Stay at Stade home. Stade Raymond Copa. Stay, stay at home. Kyle Pitts, third touchdown of the game. Oh, in yours? Mm hmm. Nice. 
All three in this quarter. Close. And I don't want to jinx it. And I asked for a breakout game for Drake May, but I think this is it. Because he's only got one incompletion. Oh, wow. He's going to throw a pick next time out. I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> this will be good for his star development treat. Yeah. Stay Jaffrey Guthrie. Alright. Hey man, it's French, not German. Use it, say it in a French accent, not that German shit now. Yeah, but Guthrie's uh, German. Uhtred was a Uhtred was a Viking on a TV show. Okay. Yeah, but this is G U I. C I know, I'm just talking shit, it just sounded similar. You ain't gotta be so so specific. No, but this! It's a joke, how about that, brother? You don't know. Brother. You don't know shit. <laughs> what a beautiful name. Matt Mutt Atlantica. Okay. Come on, Jordan Love. You could have snapped the ball right there before the end of the third quarter. Touchdown. I'm begging, begging for a uh, Amon Ross St. Brown touchdown today and a DK touchdown. Yeah. You probably get it. Who the Lions play this week? Minnesota. DK oh. plays Tennessee. Well, I mean, with a uh, Hunter control him, you you should expect a couple <laughs> of touchdowns in the way. Come on, man. You should have just had a pick. But no, you gave up a touchdown instead. Who did? I don't know who it was. I think it was uh, Cody. Oh, yeah. I think. I saw he was hurt last last game, like the Saints game, and you went in there and was looking for him. It's <laughs> trying to get him back in there. I didn't necessarily fucking... want him in there. I wanted fucking Vareed out, slow ass. He's just there to mentor. He's just to face the locker room. Yeah. I can't remember who I ended up putting in. I also cannot remember. Leggett has 10 rushes, 152 yards, and two touchdowns. This name, uh, so the team name is uh, Estac Troys, and their stadium name is Stedella Abbey. 
like Auburn. <laughs> bitches. Kill him. Oh my God, Kyle Pitts just mossed on Jair Alexander. Should have cut it up. I knew it. I knew it. Stupid, stupid, stupid. Wow, what a beautiful stadium name. What did you say, Cody? So, wow, what a beautiful, <clears throat> beautiful stadium name. It's called Park de Sports. I just forced Cal Pitts' his fourth touchdown. <laughs> nice. What's the score now? I think 49-24. Nice. And I think fucking Bradley got murdered by them. By the Packles. Yeah. They was packing that dick in his ass. Fuck you, Bradley. <laughs> <laughs> packing that dick in his ass. That's Bryce. <laughs> in the red zone. Throw him the ball. Ah, 
How? What? Come on. Cody's finna get bitched. That's the second one that he's fucking just like whiffed on. Who? Cody. Oh. He's a slot guy at best. JT Tumalo just had a uh, an open lane to the quarterback, and I guess it was so open he kind of like shit his pants and didn't know what to do, so he just stood there. What? Yeah. Who did that? The JT JT Tumalo. Oh shit. Oh my god, we just got the first unnecessary roughness penalty I've seen since playing this man called on us. Oh shit. On a fucking third down. We pushed him out of bounds. How is Matt LaFleur still employed? On the game? Mm-hmm. How is fucking Jesse and all them employed? <laughs> there you go, Co. Who finally caught his one? Should have been his third of the game. Eighteen for nineteen, two hundred ninety four yards, four touchdowns for Drake May. Nice. And I think forty or fifty on the ground. mad at this game so I'm going to uh, go over stats now <laughs> normally when I'm pissed off I don't Drake May 158.3 QB rating perfect 18 for 19 294 yards 94 completion percentage 4 touchdowns Xavier Leggett 14 rushes 156 yards 2 touchdowns Drake May 5 for 47 Tyler Algier 5 for 10 Jordan Mason, two for six. Kyle Pitts, nine receptions, 167 yards, four touchdowns. Leggett, five for 43. London, two for 25. Richie James, one for 47. Jaheim Bell, one for 12. Uh, Trenton Simpson had three tackles for loss. Damone Clark, two. James Williams, two. Eva Cady, D'Angelo Malone, and Fletcher Cox, all with one. Trent Simpson and Arnold Epicady had the only sacks. Marcus Jones, Cater Kohu, 
Interesting paints I had a pick. Who led the team in tackles? James Williams led the team in tackles with a Trenton Simpson at second. See you next time, folks. Roll Tide.